once every couple of years I can remember we had a kid wrote a, a bomb threat on a piece of paper and but yeah, it doesn't happen very often no not at all and that that was solved within minutes after it came to light so fortunately we we've, we've not had many incidences like this at least not as in my administrative time here the weird thing about yesterday is as we were dealing with that joke gone south then we got the writing on the bathroom stall um no pun intended the writing on the wall yes the yes yeah. um and, I, and i'm literally sitting here and i and i get a we had a student that took a picture of it came running down the office and said, hey, this is what's in there and um I was like, you got to be kidding me. And they're completely unrelated. There's, n I know for a fact that the first, the joke kid is not the same one that, so I can tell you that for a fact. But two unrelated incidents, but what, are, what do they have in common? Um, they are, I guess, uh, stepping on the tragedy that happened in Florida, I, I just in a weird way and everybody's on high alert. So at the beginning of, of English class, or at the beginning of class, um, they were uh, this this young man and his two friends, um, as they're waiting for class to get started, were, were actually discussing or commenting on the Florida situation and how dumb it was that this Nicholas Cruz decided, or you know, he had called in mm -hmm. and said, I'm gonna do this over and over and over. and uh, and so this this young man decided to take it further and oh yeah that's really stupid like oh i would call and say i'm going to shoot the school up next wednesday well somebody hears that mm -hmm. and then it went further um to a point where for obvious reasons you know again we're a little bit on eggshells here was fearful and his first reaction was to call a relative instead of coming year immediately mm -hmm. and then that relative called and then it just boom, went from there went from there it went yeah and then of course it got distorted and oh my god he said he's gonna come and shoot the school and mm -hmm. no those words did come out of his mouth though he was yeah. like I told you and so and I have no idea on the bathroom thing so I'm that's to me that's <clears throat> from the, all the evidence and everything that um, we've been talking to kids about the one young man the bathroom stall is is a different situation and and there will be definitely different consequences for that one so the the fear out there because of this dumb joke i mean i've got parents that were you know very concerned to the point where their children aren't coming to school possibly today or um it's hard to put a a value or a um, a, me, a, a meter on that joke causing that, yeah, I think I think we need to be very a felony. I don't know, but I would be in favor of it actually, and and hopefully kids would think a little more before they do. Well, it's just a mm -hmm. it's a really different world. Bullying and then drugs and alcohol. Those are the three main ones: relationships, bullying, and drugs and alcohol. And mm -hmm. and I we we have very very good kids here mm -hmm. at Henley, and and unfortunately we still have good kids that make stupid decisions and trying to trying to help them with that.